going on, you beautiful, beautiful people? Happy stinking Thursday, or I guess probably Friday or Saturday, whenever you guys see this delayed video. <laughs> oh, I miss talking to you guys. It's always a real treat when I know I'm about to record for you guys, because I enjoy keeping you guys updated and filled in on what we're doing. Um, man, it's been a been a good ride good fun ride and we're just continuing to becoming the best version of ourselves our off season keeps becoming pretty darn successful and i honestly have no complaints i uh, personally feel like we've had some of the most probably one of the more successful stinking off seasons of all time i mean for us anyway i i'm so just proud of myself for sticking with this darn thing, man. And I know people are like, oh, it's just a bulk, but you don't realize, guys. Like, I mean, I've actually been super just consistent with everything. Like, I, I don't make any, there's no excuses, you know, like everything's just, I'm doing the darn thing, right? I'm doing the darn thing. Uh, and I'm just so thankful, man. I got so much motivation around me too. Like I know I was in a slump a little while ago, but dang it, I think you're gonna have that. Like you guys said, Robert, I mean, all you guys, man, all you guys, you know, your kind words and, and wisdom, you're right. It's just, it's just temporary. It's not, it's not all the time, but it will happen. Like the good phrase, you know, oh, I don't lose you guys. If there was no uh, bad times, there'd be no good times, right? I feel like you gotta look at it like that. What's hate? What's love without hate? So, anyhow, we got a, uh, we got some legs today. We got a booty day. This will be our last workout before we head to Fayetteville to see my phenomenal and amazing girlfriend. I guess it'll be uh, Mother's Day this weekend. Yeah, happy. I, heck, if you guys see this on like Saturday, or I keep my guys might see it today. I don't know. We'll, we'll just see. Happy Mother's Day to your your lovely mothers that are with you or, or not, or whoever raised you as their mother. Happy day to them. I um, think I'm gonna surprise my mom. I think I'm going to. Uh, Go to Fayetteville tomorrow, right after work. So, uh, we'll spend, I guess, like a brunch with Brooks, my girlfriend's mom. We'll see her for her Mother's Day, and then me and Brooke will head to uh, my mother's, which is about three hours from that place. I'm gonna surprise her. Get some flowers, you know, something cute. She hasn't seen me in a little bit. That'd be a good thing. I'm trying to do better with the family and such. Um, but yeah, besides that, man, I mean, besides that works pretty good. Um, my boy Ben, he's he's almost there. He's he's getting there, which is kind of cool. It's been fun watching this pro. I know it's just his first show coming up, but I'm, I, I'm really excited to see how he does. Very excited. Um, I'm not going to be able to make this show, but I think... I should be able to make one of his shows. I told him I would. I'm going to try my absolute darndest to do it. Um, just got to figure out which one I'm going to. But besides that, it's super cool seeing everybody competing this summer. There's some freaks competing. So hopefully we can <clears throat> see some insane champions. But until then, your boy's going to try to work his butt off to get closer to those people. I guess I'll see you guys in the gym. Fellas, got the garage open, got the clothes on, hitting the old quads and posterior chain. Got my My Hero shirt. A little hot in here, a little warm. <clears throat> Feeling a little tired, but there's work that's got to be done, fellas. We got to get it. All right.
Not a bad first set, get 11. Go check out the film, see how it was, and uh, get three more. All right, last set of RDLs. Your boy is already feeling it a little bit. It's like a, we, you know it's gonna be hard, and I think that's why it's just a little hard. So like, you're not alone. It's like, your workout's supposed to be hard, if you remember. So, I'm gonna get my set in. Got the shirt off, cause it's hot as freaking, you know what, hot as Hades out here. We're gonna try to do the dang thing, fellas. <sighs> Oh, butts on fire. <laughs> we did it though, boys. <laughs> All right, fellas, you see the quads are getting pumped. I got a package today. Freaking, I was hoping I was gonna get it before we uh, started, but unfortunately, it's gonna be like this. Plus, we got some ghost pump. Yeah. It's not focusing. Anyway, love the product, the pump product. We received that, and then I decided they had a deal on Chris Bumstead's Essential. I got the blue raspberry. Um, it's usually not bad. The, the fruit punch was actually good. Now the Thavage, trash. It was absolutely trash, but we're gonna get this blue raspberry twine. It's got a little less caffeine. We'll see how that goes, and then what we've all been waiting for. In this special package, we have not one Yu-Gi-Oh thing sleeves, but two. Well, this sucker does not want to focus, but I'm a nerd for all you fellas that do or do not know me. Heck, I have a My Hero shirt. <laughs> but uh, I guess I'm gonna continue through my uh, calf raises. See you guys. In a second. Oh, well, where's that bicep? <laughs> Cap raises again. <laughs> Try to grill these bad boys. Kick my butt. All right, man. We are into the uh, belt squats now. Finished the belt squat calf raises. So far, so good. I remember 
a funny thing that my coach tells me. He's like, Alex, he's like, training just doesn't get easier as you progress. It, it's still going to be hard. <laughs> so it's funny how, like, we think, even with experience, like, oh, things will just get easier. But in reality, you have to remember, you got to keep pushing. And I think that's the hardest thing with staying motivated is you have to keep pushing. You have to keep striving for numbers. And it does get exhausting. I'm exhausted, especially because i got to go in here and do a lot of weights. And if anything, you're not alone. And it, it, it's tough. <laughs> it's always going to be tough because you're trying to get better than what you were. If it was easy, then everybody would keep progressing, right? So I'm going to get to doing that. Quads are feeling pretty darn just it. Even the calves, man. Can you the, look at the calves, man. So, yeah, let's get the belt squats going. All right, fellas, let's see what we can get. I think it's 8.5, so we should be able to get more than one rep, almost two. So it's gonna be a pretty challenging set. But I wanna keep good form though, too. I don't wanna trash form. Come on. Whew. Eight was a pretty good number. Huh. Yeah, that was good. Is what's always good to be nice. <laughs> and yes, I just moved a disc because I'm a good neighbor. <laughs> All right, fellas, we're gonna do a a uh, glute kickback. You might need to might need to zoom this out so you can really get everything. Yeah, I felt that one. 
Now I think we got seated calfers. I'm gonna superset it just so we're not in the gym for just an insane amount of time. So let's get to that. And I uh, guess I'll sit you guys on the uh, calf raise with me. So, uh, excuse me. Oh boy, here we go, fellas. Uh, oh man. Whew, kicked my butt. Alright, fellas, that was the end of the workout. Uh, pretty tired, but the quads felt good. Freaking, you can see, quads pretty destructive. Well, that's going to conclude the video. I'm about to get ready to travel. I love you all, and uh, you'll have a good weekend. I uh, really hope you guys do. I'm, uh, I'm rooting for you all. I guess, I think when times have been tough out here, man, it's, it's, it's easy to just forget about the, the, uh, the good things sometimes, I think. It's easy to forget about the uh, the good things. And I'm trying my hardest to stay proactive and positive and brother, you know, the headspace is definitely much better than what it was in the past. And I think the slumps, I think they just are a part of life, man. I mean, I don't think I can ever get away from it. <laughs> and I think it just bugs me more because I know what I'm capable of and I know what I'm willing to sacrifice what I have been sacrificing to be to be this, you know, version of myself that I keep trying to get to. And I feel like we're close. We're we're getting closer. And maybe that I am getting closer, it's just like the the impatience is starting to 
overwhelm me a little bit. So I gotta keep staying the course, keep doing the thing, and uh, keep praying about it. And uh, do everything in my power to, you know, make things happen. Hi, I love you guys. I said that like five times. You know what I meant. <laughs> you guys know what I mean. Have a great day. I'll talk to you guys hopefully soon.